Hello, this is Kjell Olsen from Gotvogn so I will now make a soap, soap with warm vanilla sugar type from my scented fragrance oil, oil soup or from bescented.com and it really smells lovely so in here I got my oils, my clay, my sodium lacte and a little amount of aloe vera powder my light solution with some silk, my cream and all thing <laughs> so here we start I hope I am able able to get the pattern I want this time. I will just blend the clays and all thing good up before I add my eyes. And then goes my live water with some tusa silk that is all I need that for I hope I lie in all like so and now I will pour in my cream it's whipping cream from from cup like so and I will pour in my fragrance oil now I will try to scrape it all out this time like so oh it's a lovely scent that is all I will stick them it's for now I may need to stick them it a little more with my white titanium dioxide. That will time show. And that is enough. The colors. Like so. And I will scrape my bowl down. And in here I will put some titanium dioxide because I want it white I know this fragrance don't discover so I'm taking my chance and hope it don't discover my bar so much I will stir it a little out in my hand first and see if I need to stick blend it I don't know yet it may need, need it and in here I will put black oxide
I hope I don't need to stickland this. Oh, it's fine. Just lovely. And in this I will use Regin Raspberry from uh, where can I bought it? From Tig Bakey Trading. It goes all of it. And I will stir it up with my hand. Oh, I love this color. Like so. And now for my white part. I need to stick blend it because I can see I got some specks here. And I will also add some fairy dust mica in my white. Like so. Just to give it some spar sparkling. Like so. That is just fine. And don't sniff or call for nothing if you're using the fairy dust mica. It goes all, all over, even if you are careful. I'll just try to get some air bubbles out of it here now. I think that is enough. And I can tell I got time for my pattern this time. All my colors are working quite nice for me this time. So here we start. I will first I can tell I had something on my clothes here. Like so. I will first put in some of my white. A good layer. A little more I can tell. Like so. Like so. And I will use a, what you call it, a, I don't know. And I will place that in the middle of the mold. You can see of it is like that. 
and I will pour my two colors on this like so I need my space here I will pour this I will do some tiger stripes or what you will call it like so This will be my last pour of my color. <coughs> and I will scrape this down. And I take this up like so that was not much white I will put that away and take off some of the soap I did get on my And I need to get off some of my black on my spatula here. Like so. I will just see how much I have left. I think I, I don't want to have so much for my top part just a little and I've got to say this fragrance is a wonderful fragrance to work with Like so, I think I've got to save that for my top too. And I will cut this down now. And I will use one popsicle pin to clean off my edges here.
like so. Now it's the worst part of thing. Well, now I will just use my paper. Like so. And now I will pour my white or maybe I will just place it carefully down on the top. I don't ruin my pattern so much inside it. When you're doing a soap like this, you need to have a fragrance you can work with. That give you, gives you quite a lot of time. And this fragrance did that for me. And I will rather use the time it takes to get it good. Out of but now I can or in my last hair. I love this scent. I finally found some vanilla. Vanilla scent I really love too. That I'm happy about. I will scrape my bowl so clean I can. And if this bores you, you can fast forward. Yes, last of the paper I have get out. I will tap this down a little now. I will just clean off my mess here. Like so. And now I will use the rest of my black and my pink color.
that will work for that cover. Like you see, it's quite enough of so bad better in this. Like so. Now I'm done with all my colors. So now is the top part. And I think I want to use my chopstick on the top of this up. Doing a pattern like this. Like so. And I can see I need to get some back like that. And like that. I got too much so patch, I can tell. Like so. I have to clean it up. And the soap has firmed up a little, I think. Like so, I think that will go fine. I will take off my gloves now. Because I will spray it with some rubbing alcohol. And do some glitter. Like so. Like so. And some blue. Multicolor glitter. And that is all I will do with this soap today. Um, it's still quite liquided, so I will just put it like this, so you can see it. I will show you the top tomorrow when I cut it. 
If you have a question, comment, leave them below and I will answer you. And that is all I got for now. Bye bye.